Hey folks, welcome to lesson four. It's the last week already, can you believe it? Um, we've got uh, lots going on this week. The usual stuff, we've got some reading. I tried to keep most of the reading fairly short for the week because I know you've got a lot to write, but we also have uh, a lot we need to cover still, actually, and a lot we need to think about and take from the course. So there's the reading for the week. Um, couple of videos as well, the value of reading, thinking about uh, at the end of the course the value that you, you find in reading and also a discussion of how and why we read. In this video at the end it talks about some, uh, it's for a specific course that was online that kind of had a, a group working through it. So at the end, it has some recommendations for books. It says that they'll be reading these things for the next few weeks. Just ignore that part. Um, but the rest of it is good stuff that I think you could uh, take in your thinking about reading and in the questions, the objectives that we've taken for the course. So that's the prepare section for the week. For the participation, we've got some a couple of Google Plus conversations. Uh, I've knocked down the number of responses you need. They'll all be due by Friday since that's the last day of the course. You only need two responses. Um, they should be fairly self-explanatory as well as not overly time-consuming. And also the this week's micro essays, one of which you can actually use in your uh, critical reading and writing portfolio, the learning outcomes reflection. You'll do that for micro essay number eight. So that's kind of a pulling double duty with that micro essay there. And uh, number seven will be expanding another annotation. Um, so, and also, I'm, I'm not asking you to respond to any of your peers' micro-essays this week. You can just post the micro-essays and be done with that assignment for the week. Uh, and again, your critical reading and writing portfolios will be due by uh, midnight Friday, so be sure you get those in. If you uh, need to a reminder of what's in that, you go to the assignments here, look at the critical reading and writing portfolio and take a look at the things. Again, we have the 300 word learning outcomes reflection a micro essay that you'll be doing for this week's micro essay assignment. Uh, four sample pages of your annotations from the course reading along with a brief analysis of those annotations. And you'll do this just uh, answering some questions of, of how, uh, of why you chose these annotations and uh, why they were important to you. I've got some specific questions you can ask here at the end. Now these should be uploaded to your portfolio, your your critical reading and writing portfolio folder in Google Drive that you should create per this uh, per these directions here because that's how you will submit the assignment to me is you'll grab the link from the folder you can do that just the same way you grab any other link, you just right click on it even, just to click share the folder, grab the link and send that to me by midnight Friday. That's how you will submit it. So the first thing you'll need is that uh, learning outcomes reflection micro essay, then the annotations and the preface to the annotations, and also the argumentative essay of at least 1250 words. So if hopefully things are going well for you. Hopefully your weekend was good. Um, if you have questions about anything, please do feel free to let me know.